Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your mid-March general reading. The messages will not resonate with every Capricorn who views the video, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. All right. So I have shuffled and prayed over the cards off camera, so give the cards a quick shuffle. We'll get started. We'll start with love. What are the messages for Capricorn for love? Okay. Seven of herbs. Some of you planted seeds somewhere. Some of you are in the air of expectancy. You're expecting money here or you're expecting a return on the energy, the time, the effort you put into something. Messenger of fire, knight of wands. There could be someone coming in or something coming in quickly. They aren't. 100% stable if this is a person Aries, Sagittarius, Leo but the six of fires here maybe you'll have some victory over something comes in quick that gives you victory it might be this money that you're waiting on or, or it might be this a fire sign right. five of air um, you might have had to do battle for this whole, this, this issue, this relationship, uh, this money, this return on investment, the fool, whatever this is, it sets you to a new path to where you can, you know, new development, you can start over. For some of you, this is legal proceedings, uh, Getting a final legal um, judgment, ace of fire. Whatever this is, it, it just really ignites you to, to act on something that you're very passionate about. Something that um, you feel like you can grow the high priestess. Either some of you doing some, some spirit work too. Like Ace of Fire, High Priestess. Some of you are consulting uh, spiritual people, uh, tarot card readers, psychics, because um, you just have an inkling of something, or you need to know what to do with something. Ten of Fire. Yeah, you. Some of you are laying down the burden that may have something to do with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Someone rushing in to give their their truth in a matter. It's very confusing. The sun is here. Positivity, light shed on a dark situation. Pull one more part. Two of Earth. Sometimes this is the love affair card. So maybe this is, you know, someone with who you had an inkling that there was something else going on. Uh, now you get some truth about maybe a love affair or about someone juggling. The Wheel of Fortune at the bottom of the deck. So whatever is karmically due to you will be rendered. The wheel is turning. It's turning for all of us. Whatever you've put out will come back to you. Um, wow. And then there's your card. The Wheel of Fortune and then the Temptation or the Devil card. So it looks like the wheel is turning in your favor. Maybe in regards to uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Maybe there's love here or a mutual feelings with the Two of Water. But you could be partnered with uh, Air, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. There's lies. There's secrets. There's someone devising a plan with action to move forward. To choose a new path. There's a love affair card here too. So, right. Because there's messages of love elsewhere. It looks like someone's building somewhere else with the Three of Pentacles. The truth may come out about that with the Ace of Air about this relationship or lack thereof. 
or the fact that you're trying to build elsewhere be the magician elsewhere wow and build a really solid foundation the ace of all earth or offer something solid to someone else it's a little indecision here the five of fire competition pettiness and arguing maybe due to the fact that the five of earth is here you're going to have to cut something or someone out because you've chosen maybe the other woman the empress or the other man because maybe this relationship reciprocates on a level that you're looking for or there were problems in your marriage or your relationship the the already established relationship and you're making the decision surrounding this relationship the universe is also helping you out with that with the tower and there will be divorce separation there needs to be caution in relationship wow then a ten of air because someone will feel backstabbed and betrayed this will come out of nowhere for maybe the other partner capricorn you, you're choosing someone else <sighs> Okay, let's do another spread. All right. Thank you for the messages for Capricorn, the love messages for Capricorn. True, accurate messages, messages of love and light, messages to guide. Thank you for the messages for Capricorn. Strength, a hermit. All right, you need to have strength because this is a tough situation. Some of you are going within to figure out which way to go. Oh, then the five of pentacles falls out because you know that someone, something or someone has to be left out. My God, your cards are all over the place. Maybe due to, then the Six of Pentacles, maybe due to the fact that there's no equality in this relationship. There's a, it's, it's off balance. Someone is giving more, giving more of whatever. Love, time, energy, money. Uh, you want something that reciprocates. And maybe you feel that you found that. Queen of Swords. Some of you could be dealing with the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Or you're feeling like you need to be like the Queen of Swords. Or you could have air in your chart. Cut whatever is unnecessary away. So that you can have a new start in love and or friendship with the Ace of Cups. This might even be a new start for in love for yourself. You're looking at a situation that you, you planted seed in. It's not growing, not in a manner that you wish. In which someone, you or the other person, has turned cold with the five of sword. And there's nothing but harshness, harsh, harsh words. Because something should end. It should have probably should have been ended nine nine of rods yeah you've been through a lot in this situation you're evaluating it as if should I go back into it or maybe of a fire sign saying that about the relationship with you maybe because there's a choice or you're dealing with a Gemini here with the lovers someone needs to make a choice we saw that in the last spread. Someone needs to make a choice. Justice. Eight of Pentacles. The Chariot. Queen of Cups. Some of you are dealing with cancer. 
got cancer, and then the queen of cups has cancer, then chariot cancer. Some of you are dealing with the cancer. You're willing to put the work in with them. You feel like there's equality here. It's justice for you. The bottom of the deck is the death card. Some of you are dealing with a Scorpio or just let it, needing to let a situation die. You're holding on to secrets. Holding on to the master plan here with the high priestess. Someone could be spying, page of swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Because you're thinking about choosing a new path. Messages of stability are is elsewhere. The emperor could be within Aries. Eight of cups. You've emotionally checked out. You've gotten control of the situation emotionally checked out. The empress. Wow. The emperor and the empress. I'm hearing at one time maybe you felt like this was like the dynamic duo, the relationship for you. There's a little bit of indecision as to should you stay or should you go. But, right, there's a love affair again, two, two of pinnacle, and maybe that's the other woman. And this is the woman you're with. It might be a dynamic duo elsewhere. There's indecision within yourself as to what to do. You're weighing up all your options. You're weighing, yeah, Knight of Wands. Move forward quickly. Somebody's moving forward toward you. This is grieving the third party situation. Like, okay, it's like you got so comfortable there, right? But you know you have to make a decision to go elsewhere, to be elsewhere, or to choose one partner. And for some people, they get so comfortable in this that they don't understand that the, maybe the reason why you were you were you went outside of your relationship is because you you needed to find this the two of cups and you did, but you're so comfortable here. But turn around and understand that all of this happened for a reason. Judgment, yeah. Make a final decision uh, on this in regards to um, you know this third party situation you're in. It looks like there's love elsewhere, maybe with the Cancer Pisces, Scorpio Cancer in particular. Let's get some messages of um, finance. Wow. It seems like everybody's trying to decide where to go. I think that's just life, though. These spreads will be the same all 12 months. I'm deciding to leave. I'm not leaving. I went back. Ugh. Tis, tis, tis. All right. What are the finance and career messages for Capricorn? Finance and career messages for Capricorn. Finance and career messages for Capricorn. King of Wands, the magician. Nice. Right. I don't read reversals, but I picked it up. Reverse the world in reverse. Capricorn, you may be dealing with a fire sign. That's not good energy, though. The King of Wands has been a magician. Nine of Cups. Three of Cups. Some of you were hoping and wishing for reconciliation. Four of Pentacles, you were holding on to this relationship with maybe an Aries Sagittarius Leo. They have caused hurt and pain with the Ten of Swords here. Judgment. You need to make a final decision on this. What are you going to do? The Knight of Wands, again, coming right at you. The King of Wands or the Knight of Wands? Two of Wands. Yeah, you got to make a decision where you're going with this. Four of Wands. Six of Cups. There might be children involved, but you feel like this is your soulmate. Five of Swords. The Sun. Five of Wands. Lots of change. Lots of walking away. This is supposed to be your career and finance spread, but it looks like they want to... The 
universe wants to tell you about love or love situation. Um, it looks like maybe this fire sign manifest or was hoping and wishing and definitely um, putting out to the universe that they wanted to reconcile with you, Capricorn. Even after maybe some some heartbreaks and betrayal, they they need to make a decision. Or no, you need to make a final decision. Are you going back into this? Either you're holding on to this or they are with the four of pentacles. They're rushing in fast. They want you to make a decision fast about this relationship. But take your time. It might involve children, the six of cups, or you just feel like this is a real soul connection, five of swords. Y'all are doing some real verbal battle, maybe about this ten of swords. There'll be some illumination. The sun is here, and which it'll cause you to be, have some inner conflict about moving forward. Eight of Cups, you might just choose to walk away. Have the strength to walk away and let it in with the Death card. Could be dealing with the Scorpio also. Okay, let's see if I can get some career and finance with these. Career and finance for Capricorn. Career and finance messages for Capricorn career and finance messages for Capricorn true accurate messages for Capricorn for career and finance thank you thank you thank you for messages of career and finance messages of love and light nice nine of club been through a lot but there might be a new boyfriend or a new girlfriend could be a king of club and this is also the entrepreneur so if you're thinking about five of diamond ace of club if you're thinking about um going into your business for yourself the king of club is here this is success in marriage and home this is a new passion it's starting health wealth and happiness this is some good samaritan help from the outside this also could be soulmate this could be children involved this could be hesitating before making decisions five of heart and then the five of diamond a lot of change here ten of spade because you hesitated before making a decision to go back into this relationship. It's the same cards in a different deck. This this fire sign really wants you back. They really want this. I mean, like, they are coming in hot and heavy. You know? Um, but you're hesitating because they brought nothing but hurt and pain last time they were here. Four of diamond. You hope you're guarding yourself. Wow. Okay. And you might just be letting this die. Or there might be transformation here. Maybe with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. There might be transformation between the two of you. The Queen of Diamond here. Someone is having some really agonizing thoughts about this because they were in a love affair before. Uh, it was very burdensome dealing with said individual, maybe Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Nothing but reversal, cancellation, argument, frustration, five of spades. I can't get a, a financial spread for nothing. I'm sorry, guys. The the same cards came out and went through. This will be the third deck. So that's the messages. Um, you got a fire sign coming in hot and heavy for you. They want reconciliation. They have manifest this. They have put themselves in your thoughts, in your dreams, in your driveway. I don't know. Um, they want you. But you are hesitant about, you know, like, am I, do I want to go back into this? And this could be Sun, Moon, Horizon, Fire Sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. So take your time with it. Uh, pray about it. 
um, meditate about it. Don't forget the bad times. Don't harp on the good times and don't forget the bad times either. Um, make them prove themselves. All right? That's what I'm hearing. All right. Additional mes messages of support and guidance. Self-care. Nice. Worry about yourself. Welcome the new. Okay. Family changes. Be true to you. Self-employment. To see that really big relationship dynamics at the bottom of the deck. Self-care. Self-explanatory. Worry about yourself. Put some care into self. Evaluate yourself. Have you done anything for yourself lately? Do you get your nails done, hair done? If you're a woman, pay for yourself. Now, I'm not saying you have to be ritualistic about it, but um, take care of yourself. If it, there's something you want to do for self, go out and do it. Welcome the new. The new could be anything. You fill in the blank. Uh, the, the new relationship, the new job, the new baby, because we got family changes here. So there could be someone entering the family someone exiting the family um someone coming back i'm hearing like somebody left and then i want to come back and i did we did see that uh welcome the new maybe there's transformation here we got the devil card i mean the death card three times that's also transformation maybe this person really did change but you got to be true to you and if that means i can't ever forget forget what you did i can't get over it be true to that you don't want to accept someone back and it's hell for you and it's hell for them and it just breaks down all over again if you are thinking about self-employment here's the card to um kind of solidify that thought for you um self-employment may be a big thing for you uh do your research um plan things out well self-employment may be the way to go that might be the new also relationship dynamics the relationship has changed due to the dynamics changes so on entering the relationship exiting the relationship um thoughts feelings change um you've changed you've grown the relationship uh dynamics have changed um there might like i said there was a love affair that changed the, the dynamics of the relationship. All right. So if these messages resonated with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Uh, follow me on Instago. Ask me a question or two there. I'll pull a few cards for you. Uh, request a personal reading by emailing me at tarotofl at gmail.com. Follow me on Instagram. My handles are below. What else is there to do? Choose to fund the page. Click the GoFundMe link. All donations are appreciated. Um, I think that's pretty much it, guys. Um, take advantage of the $30 readings. All right. What else? What else? What else? Remember, guys, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Um, take care, and I'll see you in April. All right.